Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a huge Walmart grocery haul. If you are new to my channel, I do um, vlogs, cleaning videos, grocery hauls, videos about my kids, just about everything on my channel, but those are the main things. I have, so I'm going to start with the cold stuff first because I want to get that stuff put up and then I will move on to the next things after I do that. So, without further ado, the first thing that I have is these on-the-go low-fat yogurt tubes. My kids love these, and these are cheaper than the go -Gurts, so we just get the great value kind. The next thing that I have is some 1% milk, great value brand. You're going to see that a lot of the stuff that I buy is great value because I'm cheap. Um, beef smoked sausage by... Hillshire Farm. We always buy this kind. It's cheap and it tastes good. Some classic Franks. I got two packs of those. Okay, in a minute. I got some string cheese. My kids love eating these after school. Okay, I'm going to fix you some milk in a minute. Yeah. I got some crescent rolls, just the original kind. Great value. One thing about Walmart grocery pickup is if I'm gonna fix you some in a minute. If you get something and you decide you are okay with them substituting it, they will charge you the same price as the cheaper thing if it is cheaper and give you something better most of the time. So I think I had the great value biscuits and these are the grand flaky layers they gave me. I'm going to fix you some in a minute. I have these Jimmy Dean biscuit maple sausages um, biscuits. I got these singles gluten-free American heritage cheese. I didn't get it because it's gluten free, but you know, it was cheap. I'm gonna fix some in a minute. Okay, I'm back. I'm sorry, guys. My son was begging for some milk. He is too. So if you have a toddler, you absolutely know that when a toddler wants something, you got to get it right then and there, honey, because they will not stop begging. So he was crying. And I went ahead and put up those few things that I showed you because they are cold. So I can hurry up and finish these. But anyways, moving on. I have these spicy chicken patties that I got for me and my husband to eat. My kids are not a fan of spicy things. So those are just for like a simple lunch for us on some bread. Some garlic Texas toast because we are always doing spaghetti or something with some kind of bread. I got these pancakes and sausage on a stick because I like to eat these and so does um, my little one. The rest of my kids are not really a fan of these. They will eat cereal every single day. Let's see what else is cold. I got these hickory smoked bacon package um, for breakfast or to put, you know, on, in some green beans or something. Um, I got these crawfish tails. Bernard's brand, just from Walmart. They're frozen. Um, these beef taquitos, just to put with something else for lunch, like maybe some fries or something. I got some corn dogs, the little kids that I watch, and also my children love to eat corn dogs for lunch sometimes, so I got the big box. I got a bag of seasoning blend because we've used this with everything. I am making shrimp fried rice tonight, so I got two bags, which I'm probably not going to use both bags, but of some mixed vegetables with corn, green beans, peas, and carrots. I got some Tyson's Bun Nuggets that are shaped like dinosaurs. My kids love these. Some buttermilk waffles. Some shrimp. These um, do have the tail on, but the medium bags, they all have the tail on, so that's why I got these, and I'll just peel it off. And I'm going to put these in my shrimp fried rice. <laughs> Some imperial butter sticks. I'm trying to make sure I cover everything that's cold real quick. 
so I can hurry up and put it up. I got two boxes of Great Value Rising Crust Pizza. I got the three meat kind and the pepperoni kind. A bag of tilapia fillets. Some silk almond milk. I drink this sometimes. I'm not like a big fan of milk unless it's going in food or something else, but my son loves milk and he has a sensitive stomach, so I will give him this almond milk. You hear him in the background? He loves milk. And no baby. Some baby Bella sliced uh, mushrooms. I'm the only one who eats these. And I'll put them with like some chicken apple sausage. Yes, baby. Um, and make me like a little pan fry with some vegetables. I know, baby. Some eye of round thin steaks to make some pepper steak. Um, I think I put something up that I got that was cold that I was supposed to show you guys. Let me see. Oh, I did. This chicken apple sausage. I don't remember if I showed you guys, but I eat these. I cut these up, put them in a um, skillet with like some broccoli, some sweet potatoes. I chop all that stuff up. Onions. It's so good and so healthy. Um. Okay. That's cold. That's cold. Okay. So now we have one, one more thing. These chicken drumsticks. Great value brand. And it is a four pound bag because we eat chicken all the time. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to go ahead and put this cold stuff yeah. up real quick, you guys, and then I'm going to show you the rest of the stuff. Alright, you guys, I put up all of the cold stuff, so I'm going to show you what else I have. I have these baby Dutch yellow potatoes. You can use these for anything. You can cook them by themselves. You can cut them up and put them in the skillet with the chicken apple sausage like I do. And the broccoli and all that. That's what I do. But sometimes I cook them with meals too. They're really good. Buttery flavored. Okay. So, sorry guys. I'm out of breath. But we love ramen noodles in this house. I don't even know why I still love ramen noodles. Because I ate them so much when I was younger. And then while I was pregnant for all of my children and then I just like completely quit eating them for a long time after I had my last son who is two years old but recently I started getting back into eating them no they are not the healthiest thing I know that if you are one of those people who are going to come on my channel and tell me that's not healthy well this is not a healthy grocery haul this is a budget grocery haul for a family of six and things that we like so just giving you guys some ideas and showing you what we like but anyways i like these hot and spicy chicken um cups so i got those for me and also i've never tried this one out but this one's called the shin black spicy um i don't even know how to say this but the nong shim noodles i'm so excited to try these out because these look really good and really spicy um, I got these roast chicken flavor cup noodles. Spi hot and spicy beef flavor. That's for me also. And then I got this big pack of beef ramen for the kids. Sometimes they'll eat them for lunch like if they don't want to eat what I cook. So that's fine by me because they know how to cook it and make it by themselves. Um, I got these teriyaki beef flavored noodles for whoever. I like these kind of, and so does my husband, so they'll probably be for us too. Alright, let's see what else. Snacks. I got these Great Value Vanilla Wafers. The kids love these. My toddler loves these, and so does the little kids that I watch. Um, these cheese dip and breadstick snacks. They're little, they're small, quick little snacks for them. And they're like a dollar something at Walmart. They're really cheap. My kids just started getting into eating these. So I just recently started buying these. Cinnamon applesauce pouches. They love these. So I got a big box. These Great Value Chewy Variety Pack Granola Bars. They have peanut butter chocolate chip, chocolate chunk, and s'mores. This 
um, cookie and cracker variety pack with vanilla creams, peanut butter, peanut butter sandwich crackers, oh, peanut butter or cheese sandwich crackers, cheddar cheese or cheese sandwich crackers. I don't understand why they put it like that, but they have peanut butter, cheddar cheese, peanut butter, vanilla, vanilla cream. Sorry, I was saying that backwards, but that little pack. My son saw someone at school bring these for a snack, and now every single day, which I think I forgot this morning, so he's probably upset with me, but I put one of these little mini Cheez-Its in his bag, and he loves these for after-school snacks, too. I'm going to show you guys what they look like. Actually, you can see on the side of this box. They're literally that tiny, and they just you just grab them out the bag and eat them. Where you can pour them in your mouth. They love them. But I get I get the regular one with just the Cheez-Its. And I also get this kind. This one has the chocolate chips, the Cheez-It kind, and the graham cracker cinnamon. Um, This value pack 32 pouch of fruit snacks. I got these for me. Which they are blueberry muffin lar bars. When I was trying to eat healthy which i kind of fall off that wagon um recently but i was doing really good for a while laura bars are gluten-free dairy-free all of those things whole 30 approved i wish that i would have finished whole 30 but i just had a lot going on and i know that's not an excuse but i did not continue eating healthy but i still love these so i still get them the strawberry fruit and grain cereal bars everyone in my house loves these so yeah I need to make a trip to Sam's and buy like the big boxes of these, but we needed stuff in the house now, so I just did the grocery pickup because if you're a mom, you know, like, it is hard to go in the store. You don't want to go in the store after school because you have your kids and they're going to ask for everything and you don't want to fight the crowd, so this is just what it's usually like lately. Alright, moving on, I got some light brown sugar. Some Velveeta cheese for macaroni or cheese dip or Rotel, whatever. This classic olive oil. I always use olive oil when I'm like frying something in the pan. So that's what I got. I never stock up on these things, so I got a couple different ones. Some beef broth, chicken broth, beef cooking stock. And some beef, little can of beef broth, because sometimes it doesn't call for very much. But so many recipes call for all this stuff, so that's why I got it. Um, I got some brown gravy mix, onion gravy mix, all just gravy mix, tomato, garlic, and basil marinade, zesty herb marinade mix ranch salad dressing and recipe mix and I got two of those packs and then I got two packs of original taco seasoning mix I got two things of spices lemon pepper seasoning for the tilapia and smoky Montreal snake steak seasoning to put on steak some original diced tomatoes and green chilies rotel original baked beans some prego 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 whatever roasted garlic and herb spaghetti sauce diced tomatoes and tomato juice and some tomato sauce some tomato paste these are all staples in my household, like things that you that I definitely should keep in here very often. I probably should have bought more of those things, but whatever. Some traditional refried beans. Some roux. You should always have roux in your house. Especially with my husband because he wants to use it for everything. Onion recipe soup and dip mix. I use this for my Mississippi roast. Some nut butter um, by the RX brand, and this is only made out of egg whites, almonds, dates, 
and it's called vanilla almond butter and I put this on my bananas some shells and cheese which I might make tonight we got a new game for the kids um, it's called chow crown and you put snacks on the forks and the crown spins around and um, yeah so you can put snacks on there and you have to try to eat them so I got some marshmallows for that I got two of these things of water, little waters because I started buying these because my kids they don't drink the whole water bottle I will end up with 20 water bottles on my counter so these are just the right amount and they finish the whole thing plus when you're on the go it's easy to just bring those I got this um, pack of yellow I mean sorry white onions a pack of gala apples everyone loves apples in the house and they get eaten very quickly um i wanted to try this aussie um sprunch mousse in leave-in conditioner for my daughter because she has like wavy curly frizzy hair it's it's a lot so i need something to tame it this um anti-cavity mouthwash fresh mint i just got the equate brand um all to me all mouthwash works the same ultra strong Citrus Twist, Citrus Twist Hefty Trash Bags because we were out. Some Snuggle um, Dryer Sheets. I am tired of buying so much um, um, vegetable oil, so I just got this big thing of it. A pack of yellow onions. A few bananas, yellow bananas. They're not ready yet. My kids are about to walk in the door any minute, so when it starts getting loud and crazy in here, that's what's going on. Some um, sweet potatoes. A whole bag of them. Okay, and then let me go over this real quick because I think I hear them coming up the stairs. I got some red bell peppers. A bunch of green bell peppers, or two of them. A broccoli puree, whatever it's called. Puree of broccoli. And a whole bunch of these yellow corn on the cobs. They are home, so if you hear the craziness, that's what it is. The last few things that I have are this bag of classic mix chips. A box of Dr. Peppers. And this 18 pack of Gatorade. If you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.